Hello and welcome to State Scoop TV. I'm Jake Williams, and today we're here with Dewan Neely, the Chief Information Officer of Indiana. How are you doing, Dewan? I'm doing good, Jake. How are you? I'm doing well, man. It's a busy time here at NASIO. But, uh, yeah. but today, you know, I want to start with a couple questions for you. Mm -hmm. what, are your, what are your top, th maybe not top three, but what are your top priorities for the year ahead? And, and you know, what challenges do you face with them? Yeah, so uh, I get, there's two that kind of stand out for top priorities in the year ahead. Um, that's really trying to implement and embrace a, a hybrid cloud approach uh, for the state agencies and, and creating that vision from a state is, is a little different. And then also uh, embracing more of the agile type uh, development technologies for our large scale multi-year projects. That, that's gonna be a major shift uh, for some of those agencies and educational opportunity for, for not only the agencies but our procurement methods for the states. So, so those are some challenges that align with that. But those are two of the, the top ones I see for the next year. Interesting. I, I think the focus on Agile is super interesting. And we've seen that really crop up on the state CIO priority list over the past couple of years. So that's, that's fascinating. Mm -hmm. So, you know, I mean, Indiana has a very diverse history of doing a lot of really cool stuff with, with technology and with IT. But, but what aspect of state IT do you think you're, you're most, most passionate about? And, and really, you know, what keeps you coming to work every morning? Mm -hmm. Uh, the, the aspects that I'm really passionate about are, are really the people, um, really the, the people that are in my shop, uh, making sure they have what they need to be innovative and that they're happy and, and free to do the, the work they need to do, but also the people in, in my partner agencies. Um, I love meeting with them and seeing how I can uh, help them get to where they need to be technologically and, and give them the, the base and the uh, the uh, platform they need to really excel. And I know as long as both of those those parties are happy, then uh, the citizens will be getting the best product, so. That's fascinating. And I mean, what would you say, uh, you know, again, I, I alluded to earlier kind of how Indiana has led in a lot of areas, but, but mm -hmm. where would you say, how, how would you say your state has been at the forefront of, of technology innovation? Uh, definitely in the analytics realm, data analytics. I mean, I, I'm speaking about it later today, and. Uh, I spent about half my day yesterday talking with other states about uh, what we're doing on an analytics front end and, and how they can participate and do things on that. So definitely we're leading the way in the uh, data analytics realm and I'm doing what I can at these events and, and working with states outside of this as well to help them, uh, usher them around along the way to, to help them do the same. Yeah, absolutely. And, and you know, when we talk about things like innovation, what does innovation really mean for your state and how, how are you guys trying to change the game? Innovation to me means giving the citizens a, uh, giving them a digital experience uh, with state government that's uh, unlike, you know, any, any other interaction with state government. You know, I think about uh, you and I um, shop on Amazon all the time and that, that interaction is, is so seamless we don't even talk about it anymore. We'll just say, yeah, I got that off Amazon and we're like, oh yeah, you know, because I know that experience. I want people to start talking about Indiana government that way. Yeah, I, you know, I, I renewed my plates, I got my license, I did all this stuff, you know, online, where it's just, they just assume a seamless, same experience like Amazon. I think that's what innovation needs to be for state government. That's awesome. And, and kind of last question for you is, you know, what keeps you up at night? What are, what are your biggest challenges out there on the job? Uh, hands down, cybersecurity. <laughs> that should be, that should keep everyone up across the nation. Um, so just continuing to battle that, it seems like it's evolving and, and getting more and more difficult by the minute. And the challenges there really is talent, finding enough expertise to help you and you know the, the salaries that that talent commands doesn't really jive with state government. So you, you really you have to bring in you know contract help to, to do some of these bigger lifts and hope that you can do a knowledge transfer and then, Hopefully you can keep that talent that picks up on the knowledge transfer after that. So it's kind of a vicious cycle, keeping up with cyber and then trying to keep the talent to, to battle back. Yeah, absolutely. Well, for more information about what Indiana is doing with information technology, with cybersecurity, with data analytics, feel free to check out statescoop.com. Uh, I'm Jake Williams. This is Dewan Neely, the Chief Information Officer for Indiana. Thanks for watching.